it's April, release day at Pinkfresh Studio, and April is a special month for Pinkfresh. It's the month we celebrate our birthday, and this year we are celebrating nine years in business. So our entire April release is based around celebration, and I'm really excited to share it with you today. Before we get into the stamps and dies, let's take a look at our latest studio essential. This is our dual tip embellishment tool. We've been sharing this a lot. Uh, we know it's kind of been a long awaited. People are really excited about it. When it is finally releasing, it will be available today for purchase. And basically, uh, it is a brass tool. On one end, you get the waxed tip for jewel picking. And then on the other end is a craft pick for poking out all of those chads. Now we put ballpoint on our craft pick so that as you're poking those out, if you get your finger, it really doesn't hurt. We've included two additional wax tips in the package uh, to get you started because the wax tips don't last forever. And in the future, we will carry them separately in our shop. All right, let's start taking a look at the stamps and dies. First is our four piece product suite called Sweet Day. This is a cake and cupcake themed set, which is so fun. You'll notice that the cake and the cupcakes are on the same stamp, so they coordinate perfectly with that one piece die. And then there is a die for one of the sentiments included on the stamp set. There's a matching hot foil plate, so you've got options. And then to tie it all together are the coordinating layering stencils, so you can color in the cakes and cupcakes extremely easily. You can color them in any colors you want. I made a chocolate cake for this card. I did a little bit of solid foiling that you see there as well. And then on this card, cake's a little bit more colorful and vibrant. Now here are some more uh, inspiration examples from our team using Sweet Day. These cakes and cupcakes are so whimsical and we really think you're going to love using them. Now up next is our ribbons and balloons set. This is a three piece product suite. You've got the stamp set, which has the balloon bouquet and the lovely sentiments. Now there's a die for cutting out the balloons and for cutting out all three sentiments. There's not a die for the balloon strings and those you will just stamp wherever you see fit directly to your project. And then of course there are the stencils which color in the balloons and then they also give you the little ribbon filigree that happens at the bottom of the balloon bouquet. So there is a card I've made using heat embossing with the stamp. And then uh, here's just a little example to show you that you can also use the stencils by themselves for that more no line color feel. Now, another great thing about this release is it's while there's a lot of birthday sentiments, it's not all just birthday. There's also other celebratory things on there like congratulations and such. So next, this is a three piece product suite called With Love. You'll see that those botanical elements are on one stamp set to coordinate with the one piece die. There is a die for that tape, which you can ink blend with the stencils, but you can also cut it out of patterned paper if you'd like. Now, I'd love to show how dainty and sweet the sentiments are included in the stamp set. You have a plethora of options. Now, I didn't get a chance to use this set yet. Here are some examples from our team and guests. They made some really whimsical and sweet cards using this new With Love stamp set, which we think you're really going to enjoy using. Okay, next is our basic banner celebrate stamp set and our basic banner die. Now this is a uh, one piece stamp that has 12 different sentiments on it, different typefaces, and then it coordinates perfectly with that banner die. And the great thing about that is we can use the banner die and we can add additional sentiment stamp sets and different themes at a later date. Now this is our rosettes collection. Uh, it's a two-piece layering stencil set, so you can create little rosettes and paper and party favors and then cut them out with the coordinating die. As you'll see, I used them that way here on this card. You can also use the die separately and cut them from cardstock or patterned paper. Uh, so lots of versatile and fun ways to use these two sets. Now, of course, you can also use the banners and cut out you know, different sentiments. That card I just showed you, I actually used one of the sentiments from With Love. And I just found a banner die that worked for it. So we're really excited about these. We think that you will be using banners and rosettes on every card you can imagine once you have these in your hands. Now the final two products in this release is our new foiled sentiments six. This is a pre-foiled 
Die Cut Sentiment Ephemera Pack. They are matte gold and matte silver, and they're all celebration themed. You've been asking for that, and so we answered this month because it was perfectly fitting. And then we do have a final die set called Wrap Around Elements, which you'll see I used quite a bit on this card. There's that fun fringe, there's a couple of border dies, and then there's that cute little bow that goes together perfectly. These are really super fun for uh, using on cards, layouts, all kinds of paper crafting projects. So here are some final examples with these last two uh, products that I shared with you. And that is our entire April celebration release. Uh, we do have a blog hop going on, of course, celebrating this new release. You'll definitely want to hop along and see even more inspiration with all this new product. We will post a link in the video description below. And don't forget, there's also a ton of giveaways. Now, finally, speaking of giveaways, we have a grand prize giveaway right here on this video. All you have to do, let us know in the comments below what your favorites are from this release. And keep in mind, I didn't say you had to pick just one. Well, that's our April release, friends. It's available in the shop. We can't wait to see what you create with it when you